Hey Mustangs, Brain Bust, Episode 5. So far we've talked about screen fatigue, turning on that switch, neural pathways or roads in your brain, and multitasking. Today we're going to talk about something that we all deal with, change. Change, change, change. And we're going to talk about the brain reason why change can feel difficult or weird or wrong. Sometimes we think that a change that's coming is not right. It shouldn't be happening. And I'm going to tell you why that is. Okay? So some of us are fine with change. Some of us love it. Some of us do not. I am in that second category. You're all military kids, which means that you've all dealt with a lot more change than a lot of other kids in this country. And sometimes I think that being a military kid means that you're grown-ups, whether at home or at school or at church or wherever, expect you to just be good with change and to just roll with it and to just have a good attitude right out of the gate, right? That's not always the case. Sometimes you've been at the same school for five years and you don't want to change. Or sometimes you've had the same friends for a certain amount of time and you don't want to get new ones. Or sometimes you have to switch sports teams and you don't want to because you're used to yours and you like it that way. Sometimes you move off of, the in, off of an installation and into a house um, that you're just not used to yet. And sometimes all of that can feel kind of strange. And the reason it feels strange, the brain reason, is because of something we've talked about before, your neural pathways. When you're doing something that's familiar to you, you have those roads already built. When you have to do something new, you have to build a brand new road, which I know you know that already because we talked about it, but think about it in terms of changing something. Whether it's you're changing a bad habit to a good habit, it's going to feel wrong and it's going to feel weird because you don't have that road yet. Or you're changing schools. It's gonna feel really strange, like I don't belong here, I don't wanna be here, I shouldn't be here. That's because you don't have that road in your brain yet. And you have to make it. You have to forge it, you have to travel it, okay? The brain reason why change feels so weird and so difficult is because you have to make your new roads in your brain. And there's two ways to do that, which, we talked about in the neural pathways episode but I'm going to remind you of when you have to change something in your life whether it's forced or you want to change it there's two things you have to do to build that road to be a strong road and to make your change successful the first is to practice get up get out and go do it okay get up get out and go do it if you're changing schools you really have no choice but if you get up and get out and do it with a good attitude, your road will be stronger. You'll get used to it faster. Because when you have a good attitude, it's kind of like you're traveling down that road at a faster pace than if you don't have a good attitude. So the faster you travel down that road, the more of it can be built and the quicker you get used to whatever that change is. Okay? So first thing, practice, practice, practice. Second thing, growth mindset statement. You had to know I was going to say that, right? Growth mindset statement. I'm not used to this, but I will be with practice. I don't have any friends here, but I can meet people and get friends, right? If you're changing new schools. If you're changing a habit, you have a habit that isn't so good for you and you want to get to a new one, same things apply. Number one, practice, practice, practice that new good habit. Build that new road. Let that old one Get overgrown with weeds. Don't travel it down. Don't travel down it anymore. Just go down your new one. Okay. And number two, come up with a growth mindset statement to keep you going on that road with that growth mindset statement. I can't do this yet, but I'll be able to with practice. Right. So, practice, practice, practice. Growth mindset statement to build those new roads to be strong. Build those new roads faster and stronger to make your change successful. Okay? See you later.